One of the 13 founding states of the US, Pennsylvania is proud of its history. But it could also have a significant part in shaping the country's future. It's possible that delegates here from Pennsylvania could end up deciding whether Donald Trump gets the nomination from the Republican Party. That is because there is no other state that has so many delegates that are free to support whoever they want at July's convention. Veteran Republican delegate Charles Garreau has been voting for presidential candidates at his party's conventions since 1976. This is the first time in my memory where the Republican Party isn't simply nominating the next guy in line. And that's been a tremendous plus for the Republican Party this year. The energy, the enthusiasm, and the interest in the Republican primaries this year has been at record levels. That's a good thing for the party, it's a good thing for the process, and ultimately it's a good thing for the country. The communications professional will vote against Donald Trump if he thinks another candidate has better chances of beating Hillary Clinton. But will a vote against Trump translate into an existential crisis for the Republican Party? I don't know why that would put anybody into a crisis. The rules of the convention are very simple, and they have been for a long time. You have to have a majority. If you don't have a majority, you can't get the nomination. Lawyer Mark Skaringi is trying to get elected as a delegate for the first time. What does he think will happen if Trump doesn't get nominated? It could mean disaster. It could mean the party is broken because the establishment that runs the party is trying to stop Trump from winning on the first ballot. If they do that, they'll bring in John Kasich or some other candidate and the Trump supporters and the Cruz supporters may then bolt leave the party, which would leave the party in shatters. That's not really appealing. Skaringi sees Donald Trump want, as the only candidate us. who can lead America into a better future. And I was invited to come right up near... I will vote for Donald Trump uh, at the convention in Cleveland, the Republican National Convention, even if Donald Trump does not win the popular vote in Pennsylvania. A token of gratitude for his support. He had this picture taken with the current Republican frontrunner. Delegates such as these two could, for a short while, be the most important men in the country. But will the candidates possibly try to influence them with promises or even money? Questions no one in Harrisburg wants to answer on camera. But it's no secret that the tug of war for the delegates is underway. Out in the countryside, Little is felt of the state's new significance. Here, it seems that all the excitement, like anything else, will come to pass.